With Treeit, you can create your own realistic or stylized custom trees and use them for your commercial product. If you don't have the software yet, you can get it from the website Evolved Software under Treeit. On the website, scroll down and you can choose between the XC or the Steam version. If you want the Steam version, you will have to pay about 4 euros. The EXA version is free and has the same features, so you can decide if you want to pay for it and support the developers or just use the free version instead. This is how the viewport looks like if you open Treeit. You can move around with left click, right click and the middle mouse button. On the right there are 5 different categories and you can customize everything about your tree within those categories. I won't go through all the options but only some important features to customize your own tree. Let's start with the trunk of the tree. Here you can customize everything about the trunk, but let's start with the texture first. You can use your own texture or choose one that comes with the software. For the tutorial I will go with one texture that comes with Treat. Select the textures of the base, blend and stamp here. And when you apply it you will see the result in real time. And I will quickly show you how the tree changes if I use a different blend material. You can also invert the blend with the button named Blend from Top. Now you can change the trunk until it is exactly what you need for the project. But let's continue with the branches. Here you can set the amount of branches and how the branches should look like. If the performance and the poly count is important to you, you can always see below exactly how many polygons the tree has. So let's go to the next category, the leaves. Here you can add multiple leaf types and change each leaf type individually. Let's select a leaf and give it a new texture. In here go ahead and select a texture from the leaf and for the stem. After that go up and select a number of leaves and generally customize everything about the leaf until you are happy with how they look. When I now select the second leaf, I can assign a new texture to it and uh, again select how many leaves I want of this type. Now you can play around with the customize options until you are satisfied with the result of the tree. In a moment I will show you how to export the tree, but if you like it so far, please leave a like and subscribe. If you want to export your tree, go to File, then Export and choose your file format. I want to export the tree as an FBX file. After that you only have to select the folder and when we have a look inside of the folder, we will find the FBX model of the tree with all the necessary textures. And that's it with Treat. Now you just have to import the tree into your project and set the materials for the textures. Thanks for watching. Bye.